Hi guys, welcome back. On Monday, the parties filed oppositions to omnibus motions to seal. Notably, the defendants continued to focus on the William Hinman speech-related documents, leaving the hope of a settlement on the table. On January 13th, the parties must file the Daubert motions, and all parties and non-parties must file oppositions to the non-party motions to seal on January 18th, previously due on January 4th. John Deaton offered a counterpoint to a paragraph in a document in the SEC's lawsuit against Ripple. The claim is that since the crypto company relies on XRP sales to support its operations and capital expenditures, it demonstrates common interest with cryptocurrency holders and gives them the impression that the price of XRP will go up as a result of Ripple's efforts. The SEC claims this information as proof that Ripple and XRP are a common enterprise and that the cryptocurrency is a security. The argument is further supported by the fact that Ripple offered crypto exchanges compensation for listing XRP, which according to the Howey test used by the regulator to determine security status, also makes them a common enterprise. The resolution of the SSC lawsuit plays a major role in how XRP prices perform in 2023. If this happens and the crypto market continues to rise steadily, XRP can easily reach $1. Most analysts are predicting such a move, especially after the bearish 2022 year. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and watch our other videos to know more about XRP and Ripple.